Okie dokie. So, recently I posted a video that was me just casually playing Knocked, and that was supposed to be kind of like a, you know, homage to my videos I made five years ago. Well, my next video that I did on that, after that, was uh, Verrucked, where I played Verrucked. So, I figure it'd be the perfect thing to do to play it again, just 100% casually, not doing any sort of challenge or specific strat or anything like that, just playing and having a good time. So we'll see how it goes. And I think that I will eventually, who knows how long it'll take, but eventually do a casual playthrough of every single Zombies map. So without further ado, this is the second one. All right, this is annoying. Come on, get in here. There we go. There's somebody else in here too. Yep. Yeah. Hello. Alright, cool. There we go. That's how we move on. Okay. Do I want to get the bolt action rifle? I know I talk crap about it, but I mean at least the car is somewhat good. So yeah, I'll, I'll grab it. Why not? Now do I want to stay here? Or do I want to move on? That is the question. And I'll probably wait until I can buy a couple more doors first. Okay. All I'll say is this is definitely a lot better than the Springfield, I'll tell you that much. Like, oh my goodness, I can't believe I even got to round six using that weapon. But something tells me that if I really, really wanted to, and maybe if you want to see it, let me know, I could probably get to round 10. Maybe that'll be something I do want to stream sometime when I get better internet to stream. But for now, it's just these. Hello, Mr. Zum. Oh, the shot. Okay. Well, we're moving on. Let's get cracking in round three. Okay, so this is... A grand, I think the next one's a grand, and then the last one's 750, I believe. So, we could have the power turned on by the end of this. I don't think I ever buy uh, the um, words. I don't think I ever buy the rifles in World at War. I can't remember the last time I have, um, like the Kuver and the uh, M1A1 and stuff. Not because they're bad or anything, I just, just haven't done it. I mean, I'm not a big fan of them, okay. I mean, I'm not a big fan of them, but that's just me also, so. Someone in here. Maybe it's time to move on, huh? Alright, guys, let's boogie on through. You are... Oh, you're just 752. Max ammo. Right, let's buy you. MP40. Okay. Alright. Well, after doing that hip fire challenge, it feels weird being able to aim down the sights again. That was something that I really didn't think would be that difficult at all. I mean, and it really wasn't. It was just honestly me just overthinking everything why I died. I mean, I know I said that in the video itself, but I really do feel that's to blame. It's just my dumb self overthinking everything. Okay, so I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to try a strategy I saw where you just you don't buy that door between Quick Revive and the uh, rain room there, the water room. So I think I'm going to try that strategy out. And I saw that a long time ago. And it looked like it did pretty well, so that's what I'm going to try to do for this. And we'll see how it goes, ladies and gentlemen. So I do have my Kool-Aid Jammers with me, so hopefully it'll give me the strength I need to succeed. I don't have my Crocs on today, but hopefully hopefully it doesn't debuff me too much. Alright, zombies. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah. World at War will always be one of my favorites, definitely just because of the nostalgia factor, but I mean, it's still 
in my opinion, just so much fun. I mean, sure, the movement isn't as great and the maps aren't as big and expansive, but depending who you are, you'll... Oh man. you like the more simple gameplay. Because I definitely know I do, to a certain extent. Alright, the question is then, since I'm basing this off of how far I got in my other video, how far did I actually get in that video? I don't think I've uh, looked on that one. I know that one was one I put in three parts. But I uh, definitely remember part three was only like a minute long because I died right after I started it again. So that was back when I had an aversion for some reason for making a YouTube video longer than 20 minutes. So, I mean, I realize that people aren't always going to watch the super long ones, but, you know, depending on who you are, you might like those. So this is definitely something that I wanted to put together and have to, you know, make sure there's diverse amount of content on this channel you know leisure relaxed stuff and also high edited nice stuff and more scripted stuff so this is just off the collar stuff so we'll see how she goes right, boys mm -hmm, mm -hmm. the one problem is if uh, I do it like this I'm not gonna be able to get jug right away but and that's also fine too. I mean, I don't need jug, but then saying that, I'm probably just gonna get slapped like nobody's business. So, okay, we will. Hmm. You know what? I'm gonna use this double points, get some points, and then buy jug and ammo because I don't want to risk it. Let's buy some ammo. Uh, thank you very much. And we will get perked up here. So this way, we won't be caught with my pants down. Sweet. All right. Who's coming? All right. We got multiple guys. All right. Cool. Cool beans. Yeah, I might even end this round with enough points to move on. Nope. Not quite. Well, I could always build barriers, couldn't I? La da 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 taking a drink of the Kool-Aid. But don't drink the Kool-Aid. Okay. Round six. Alright. I wonder if this is the round with the Varuk sprinters on them. I guess we'll see, won't we? 750. And why am I going around all this way? It seems kinda counterproductive. But I heard that's the way to do it, so that's why we're doing it. But, beef. This map is definitely the spookiest of all the zombie maps. That's for sure. But, I don't know, they really did, did well with the atmosphere here. Food, water, atmosphere. or getting somewhere. Now the question is, is if for some reason I do get far, and I do get to a far round, should I buy the overpriced bar in the room? The deployable one that doesn't even deploy. I think I should just for the meme, but also at the same time I don't think I should because that, you know, assaults my pretzels. Ooh, you guys are coming in pretty good. Oh, I should have reloaded for that. Oh well. Oh, there's two Bouncing Betty wall buys on this? I didn't actually know that. And I'm being serious too. It's not like a you know, being cute thing. I really didn't know that. I know there's a couple bar buys because there's this bar here. Yeah, bar plus bipod. $2,500. Is there a more expensive wall buy in Zombies? I don't think so. Or maybe the Titan and Black Ops 4. I know that's 3,000, I think, but man, that's ridiculous. All right, yeah, so the idea is having this closed so all these people don't come in because then you just have the one barrier here and the one there and you have all this space to work with, so I think that's really it, I guess, but, and I guess there's two wall buys for that, too. Not two wall buys for you, though. Cool beans, round seven. Well, 
I beat my Springfield round record, so yippee. Let's see if we can keep this gravy train rolling, shall we? Uh, I'm definitely be buying Speed Cola eventually. Double tap, probably not, but we'll see. And obviously, Quick Revive doesn't work on this game, which is hilarious. Okay. Hello, zombies. <laughs> I feel like they're kind of like glitched out deciding which barriers to go to. That's funny. There's a Verruckt Sprinter. Yeah, Verruckt Sprinter. Hey, fellas. Yeah, actually, this ain't bad. You know, if you get... Well, I was going to say, if you could get four people to do this, that'd be sick, but those people would be stuck in that room for a while. I guess, I suppose you could do it. Okay. Yeah, this actually seems like it seems to be the best way to do her. At least for now. I mean, obviously I'm only on round seven, so nothing extreme, but... We will see, won't we? Okay. And this map, of course, they added all the perks because they didn't have those in Nacked. Um, and as far as I know, that's really the only big thing, all the power and traps. They didn't have those, so this map made a big improvement. And plus, the way the zombies move was a lot different, too, so... You know, which is cool. Hey, I did it. Definitely not what I expected. Okay, we'll keep you. Now, we'll buy you. And you're 1,200, which is funny. Yep, for weapon 1,200. Because, does it say it's 1,500 on this? Like it does in, uh, whatever. Because I don't actually know if it does. I know it does in, uh, not, but I don't know if it says it's 1,500 or not. Not like it's a big deal. Okay. Now, personally, I like the Thompson better than the MP40, but that's just that's just me. That's what I use in my Noct video. That's what I'm gonna use here. Don't even really feel like spinning the box, honestly. I mean, I might later, but for now, I don't really know. Hello. And that's a Varuk Sprinter right there, boys. Super fast. Super, super fast. Rad. Okay. We're doing it. And... Uh, pff, yeah. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, it's funny. Okay. Let's see how we do. Alright, we're doing well, kiddos. We're doing well. Hmm. Sure. Balancing Bettys. We'll put one here. I don't know why I would ever go back there, but I guess I did in my Springfield video, so you never know. <sighs> and then we'll line them up in here. This is what we'll do. Okay. And it didn't. I don't know. I don't know what round it's a one-hit kill on anyway. But I mean, you know, obviously the more the merrier I have in a spot. So we'll kind of see what I can do. But this map was definitely harder than Knocked. I felt like even with the inclusion of perks, I felt like it was still harder. But of course, who knows if it actually is? I wonder if they have the limit on zombies on this, like they do in. Uh, Shinonuma, because they have a 24 zombie cap on that map. I don't know if they have that on this, too. But once I get to round 10, I'm going to pause to see what round I got to in my old video I had. Alright, so here we go. So I'm going to go ahead and pause right now, and then we'll uh, come right back and tell you what I got to in my old video. Alright, I'm back. So, my video five years ago where I played Varuk, I got... It's one minute and one seconds long and I die on round 11 on insta-kill with the ray gun. So, I'm not gonna be getting the ray gun, cause you know, it's a more of a detriment than it is a help, unless you have PhD. 
but that's not in this game now, is it? Hello, zombies. Hello. Hopefully that doesn't actually make any... Yeah, okay. I was going to say, hopefully it doesn't make any crawlers, but there we are. Oh, shoot. I should uh, put down some Betty's down. What am I doing? Uh, is there a certain round where the zombies come through the uh, um, wall door or not? Because I don't see them yet. Thank you. Okay, don't swim me, you jerk. Okay. Perfect. Okay. Okay, I was gonna say, I hope they're not like right there and destroy my Betty's I just placed. Alright, there we go. Perfect. We're doing it, kids. Alright, so round 11 is where I got last time. Uh, when I played Varuk all those years ago. So let's at least try to beat that, shall we? Um, and then we'll try to beat round uh, 17, because that's what I got on uh, Knocked. So hopefully we can do it. I think so, but also the instant I get uh, the instant I get confident, that's when I'll get insta clap. So let's not do that. And I know, like, the high round strat on this map that people do is, uh, you know, running and using the electric traps and stuff, but I don't know. I don't really want to do that. I just think I'm just going to play and shoot and point and shoot, and I doubt I'd get to the point where I'd need to do that anyway. So, I mean, I guess we'll see. I mean, so far this is going pretty well, but... Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Come on, guys. Shuffle on in here. And they're running around the whole dang map. You the last guy? No, there has to be one more. Ah, uh, yep. You must be the last guy. Oh, well, looks like I'm having to buy ammo pretty much every round. Which is fine. Not a big deal, but... Cool beans. I might put some Bettys over here, too. I already have two in each of those spots, so... This way it kind of gives me something in case I need to loop around or someone finally comes out of that barrier. Up, oh, yep, and look at that. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Okay, well, let's get you, sir. Okay, well, now things are going to heat up a little bit and get a little spicier if they're coming through this door. So, hello. Oh, don't grab me. So you kind of stick to the zombies in this one compared to the other ones. But the thing is nice is they can't swipe you while you run by them. So I guess there's trade-offs. But just don't get too close, you know. Mind those social distancing policies. All right, here we go. Now it's getting perfect. I think they're starting to get a little warmed up. Hello. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, fellas. There's plenty of enough me to go around. All right, sick. Now I can use my MP40 again. This has more ammo than the Tommy gun, but it's not as strong, I don't think. I mean, it, it might be for all I know. All right, hey, we beat round 11. I guess I didn't notice that earlier, but yeah, we beat round 11, so that's sick. Beat round 11, we beat round 12. We are cruising. Okay, and I'll put one in this corner. Alright, sick. Sounds about right. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Hey, zombies. Okay. I wonder uh, when it'll be too much to manage. I mean, I should try to get the PPSH, though, because that's, you know, one of the best weapons in zombies history. Um, but I don't really feel like spinning the box over and over again to try and get it. But who knows? We'll see it. We'll probably take some stabs at it later on. If we're still alive and kicking, that is. Which, so far... Oh, jeez, come on. So far, so good. <laughs> I wonder... Uh, I know that they uh, 
don't have support for the Call of Duty uh, I f or I Touch game anymore. Uh, the zombies one, but I wonder what like the high round on that is, like legit high rounds too, not like some kid cheating. But okay, I think this guy might be the last guy. All right, let's go uh, check out the box then. Try to get something, something. At least get rid of the MP40. We're keeping the Tommy, but. Oh, all right. Even though I can't move with that thing, you know what? It's a classic. You can't play World at War without it, so I'm taking it. Yeah, good luck, I guess. <laughs> all right, Irony. Let's go. And in the remake, Mule Kick is right there, you know? The, I mean, I like that perk. I don't think it gets way too much hate for, you know, what it serves, but also... The fact that it's on the map as opposed to, you know, like, other things is weird. But, again, what do I know? Okay, we gotcha. See ya. See ya, zombies. Alright, we're doing it. We're doing it. Now, personally, I think my goal for all the World at War maps solo should be about 15. I mean... I still, I'm impressed that I got the 17 on Knocked. I mean, I know that's not, like, amazing or anything, but, you know, if you would have told me that when I first played it, it would have been impressive. So, let's just try to make that a conservative goal here in case I slip up. Because these casual ones are definitely a one-time go. So, like, if I, you know, slip up and do something dumb and die at round three, that's, that's it. That is what it is. It's just a casual run. I mean... In that situation, I'd probably just keep it live, keep recording, and then just restart the map, but um, everything is going to be kept in there, because I don't want to, you know, I don't want to try to script too much on stuff like this. Perfect. All right. That is... Let's put more in this corner. Don't come sprinting at me. Okay. All right, we'll buy more ammo, because we have plenty of money to spend. Yay! <laughs> I'll take as many of those as I can get, thank you. Uh, Alright. We doing it, boys. We doing it. We doing it big. Okay. Perfect. I want to at least use my Bettys. Like, if I die, I want to remember that they're there so I can uh, run over and use them. Otherwise, I'm going to be really disappointed in myself if I don't. You know, do all this stuff and then don't even do it. Uh huh. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Alright, round 16. Sweet. Alright, round 17 is what I got on my other video of not correct. I'm pretty sure. I'm not gonna check, but I'm pretty sure that's what I got. And so I remember, though, going off on another tangent here, uh, when I made my original videos back in 2015, that I was going to do just a playthrough of all of the maps, especially the World at War maps, because I love World at War. And I just, I guess, never got around to doing it. I was just busy with uh, college stuff and other life things. So now that I have more free time on my hand, uh, hands, I will definitely try to do that, and I'll play the other zombies maps as well, because, okay, 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 hang on, hang on, just hang on, I don't want the four of you to be my freaking demise here, okay, sweet, <laughs> oh, that's perfect too, getting the max ammo like that, excellent, what is that, double points, because we totally need that, all right, sweet, round 17, right where we wanted to be, And do I get my others? Yeah, I do. Alright, we'll get you in here. Place both of you in here. How about that? Perfect. Okay. Will I beat round 17? Stay tuned to find out. I'm gonna go ahead and say yes, I will, but with that, watch me die. Because that's exactly what I did on my uh, knocked one. I got too confident. Granted, I know I didn't have perks, because they don't have the perks on it, but like... <laughs> You know, there's a point where 
I really just need to kind of take my own advice and stop being too overly confident on some of these maps because then I'm just gonna end up uh, hurting myself. Yep. Do 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 do. I wonder what the legit high round of this is. I bet it's something crazy. Like there's no way someone hasn't gotten to like some ridiculously high round on this, especially if they do like that electric trap strategy. You last guy? Hey, we did it! We beat round 17! New high round for this out of the two maps I played! Yay! Alright, well that's good. Let's take a celebratory sip of my Kool-Aid Jammer. And it is cherry flavor. Although I believe grape is the best Kool-Aid Jammer flavor. Yeah, look at that. They like went to that barrier for a second, which... <laughs> it's funny. Oh, world at war. You're glitchy, but I love you. <laughs> cool beans. Cool beans, cool beans. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I died counting the zombies last time because I just had a thought in my head. I was like, hey, I should try to count them and see if there's that cap. Uh, how about no? Because that's what I did on Knocked. A uh, thank you, Insta Kill. Blah, blah, blah. you it <laughs> hey oh man the later rounds are just so much shorter on this and I absolutely love that oh it's amazing okay sweetness though we're doing it big round 19 sounds good to me fellas sounds good to me I guess I shouldn't say fellas ladies might watch this as well uh, people I guess I should say people um, everybody who enjoys my content if you enjoy my content, that is, and don't just watch it out of spite. That would be funny. Someone just watching that just like, I hate this, but I want to watch anyway. It'd be really weird, but I guess... Ah! All types of people in the world in there. Okay. You guys can stop, please. Would you kindly stop? Okay. Alright, well now that I'm on this, 19, hopefully I can get more blessings and get... Uh, more nukes because that would be awesome if I could. I mean, I know. I know that. Uh, I don't think this map is too stingy with it, but. I thought I was close there. I think. Are you the last two guys? Three. Nope. Where's the last one? Ooh, hopefully it like glitched or something and there's one just like somewhere. Cause I've had that happen before where the game will just glitch and no zombie will come. So if that happens, okay, cool, there we go. All right. Sweet, round 20, there we go. Yeah, I've had it happen before where I played Ascension with friends, or Ascension, yeah, Ascension with a friend and also uh, Darice, where some a zombie will be like stuck in a wall or something when it spawns or something like that and so we've quote beat the map because you know no one's coming after us anymore so yes we have I have beaten zombies before I know I know don't mean to brag but I am really that cool uh, people all right, let's see what round I can get to on this. I am not thinking... I honestly didn't think I'd get... Oh, oh, no. Did not think I'd get to round 20. So, hopefully I can... Oh, dude. Oh, pff. oh well, okay. That was... R no way. That was super quick for that. <sighs> okay, well. I'll still take it. 20 is not bad on Veruk, so... I'll take it. I'll take it. Alright, well thank you very much for watching this video. If you enjoyed, leave a like, and if you like these chill videos, be sure to let me know, because I enjoy making them. They're a lot of fun, and it's just a lot of fun to just talk in a way that I don't really get to as much. So if you like the video, leave a like, like I said, and I'll leave a comment if you enjoyed it too, and remember to subscribe, and have a great day.